So I think the first thing I want to try is actually Galarian Moltres. I actually think Galarian Moltres is a little busted. Because the last time we had Galarian Moltres, you have to realize that we didn't... We had Dynamax. Like, it couldn't flinch everything. It couldn't flinch everything. So that's actually a pretty big deal. Um, I think that, like, we can do Wo Chen stuff. I know that I'm, like, you know... It's kind of a meme that I use Wo Chen all the time. No, I actually think that like Wo Chen Moltres is actually like decent. Flutter main. Um, I would like to use Landorus T. I think Landorus T is solid on here. And what else? Titar with the Titar with what? With the Moltres? I don't I don't think so. All right, let's see. Hold on, let me check something. I had an idea with this. I was just at work all day, like, brainstorming. Oh yeah, an iron bundle. And iron bundle. It's like, that's, this is like a team I could try to build around, or if you guys would prefer, I can actually build around one of the new Hisui Pokemon. How do you make optimal EV spreads? It entirely depends on what's popular in the game and what you want the Pokemon to do. It's kind of hard to sum it up in a few seconds. I think Luna Navy or Shrew is good. Honestly, I'm kind of... I kind of want to do Enamorous. I think we're going to do Enamorous. Because I think Enamorous Ting Lu is actually a really solid combo. Let's do like Enamorous Ting Lu. Um, and I'm going to be doing Contrary Physical Enamorous, obviously. So, the only thing about Enamorous is doubling down on Fairy types doesn't seem that great. So, I don't know if I would want to run... I don't know if I would want to run, like, um... You know, whatever it's called. Fluttermane next to it. However, I could see Chen Pao being a decent option, but at the same time, not really. Does Contrary re uh, reverse the Ruin abilities? No. The Ruin abilities are not a stat drop. I I've... So, a lot of people ask this. Does Contrary or Defiant affect the rune abilities no they're not stat drops it's a passive effect trick room team i don't think so not with enamorous not with this version of enamorous maybe with the other version of enamorous um hmm what's like a decent intimidate mon i can fit on here Let me think of defense, of course. All right, so this guy's weak to steel, ice. Is that it? Poison, steel, ice, rock, and electric. Inglu covers a few of those pretty well. A water type would be appreciated in that case. Um, I think bundle is not bad. Bundle would make it easier to get our superpower boosts off and also like these two together seem just solid because you can kind of uh disincentivize them from wanting to protect gyarados also wouldn't be that bad neither would lander's t i think i do want to put a king gambit on here though i think that king gambit's a solid pokemon especially with like sword dance and stuff halifin probably actually maybe we drop this and like this is our like fa our four like main thing going on uh amoongus is obviously gonna be quite good might end up dropping gambit to be honest we'll see yeah these four seem solid amoongus tinglu palafin uh let's i don't know if i want landorus because landorus would just be another ground type what are the fire types we have at our disposal right now Um, we could try his Sui Typhlosion. I don't know if it's actually that decent with these guys. You should use Urshifu. I think Urshifu will end up on this team. Maybe over Palafin Hero we can do Urshifu, but I also just think Palafin Hero is good. Into a lot of things in this format. Hmm. Let me think. This 
Sarah Legend Ting Lu is good. It is, but I don't know if I want to run Sarah Legend Amorous Ting Lu. I don't want like a special attacker. We do Arcanine. Then again, Arcanine might not even be like good anymore with all these like ruins running around. Maybe it is. Maybe it's like a decent mon. Hisui Arcanine is like god awful though. Lando T. The only thing with Lando T is we're doubling down on ground types. I don't know if I want that. A lot of decent water types now. Alright, we could use a steel type. That's something I'm seeing immediately. Memento Grim Snarl and Enamorous. Memento, you can't, you can't activate. Actually, I guess you could. I'm thinking of Defiant, but it's still not worth it. Losing a whole Pokemon. Heatran. Yep, no, you're right. It's going to be Heatran. Heatran. And then like Cresselia. Actually, Cresselia is not bad. Yeah, I like this. This is like an annoyingly fat team. Let's do that. This is really good. Yeah, okay. Um, for the Palafin, let's just do what we've been doing with like Palafin in this format. You know, just do like the standard like 12 speed Palafin. 4-4. Four, for four. the Mystic Water. Uh, I want to do Wave Crash, Protect, Jet Punch, Haze. I might need to drop Haze for like a coverage move. Maybe like Ice Punch to hit like um, Zapdos. As for Enamorous, what do I want my item to be? I know I know for Heatran, we probably want to go with like... We can actually do Safety Goggles and like Terra, Terra Grass. Actually, maybe not Terra Grass Safety Goggles, but like... Maybe... Chocoberry? I don't know. Here, let's get the moveset. Heat wave, flash cannon, earth power, protect. Go with a modest nature. Max HP, like four speed. Let's um let's do this. This is all vibes, by the way. Sometimes you can just make EV spreads off of vibes and it works. Actually, mm, let's go more Fizz Def for Freddy Fazbear. And I actually might do Air Balloon. That's probably a bad idea. Let's do Shookaberry. I think I want to do Assault Vest on you. We'll do Ruination. Stomping Tantrum. Actually, we can do Earthquake pretty reasonably. Ooh, what if we choice... I'm going to choice band it, actually. Rock Slide. All right, we'll do Terra Fire. I'm going to do absolutely zero speed. Brave. I'm just going to do this. Rock Slide, Earthquake, Heavy Slam... I can just do Stomping Tantrum as my last one. Hmm. No, Cresselia doesn't get Expanding Force. For Cresselia, I definitely want to do like Protect, Helping Hand, Trick Room. Protect, Helping Hand, Trick Room, and like Psy Shock. I could also just do Dazzling Gleam, I think, and go with Terra Fairy, because that's like a really decent defensive Terra type for it. Leftovers. Citrus Berry might be better. I think for Enamorous, obviously, Superpower, Protect. Leftovers isn't the worst item, honestly. 
Play rough iron head. We just go Terra Steel. Jolly Nature, make sure we outspeed the base 100s. That's going to be, what are the base 100s at? Let me check real quick. Shotgun's going slow. Wow. All right. So they hit at a timid nature. 167, so I want to hit 168. Nice. Um, if that's the case, if we're building it bulky, I think that what I can do is just open up the Nerd of Now damage calculator. And I think all I want to do is be able to one-shot Tinglu at plus one with like play rough. Like max HP Tinglu. If that's even possible. Enamorous. I don't think that's possible, by the way, but we'll see. Oh, yeah, no, that's not possible. Not even if we were to go like Adam and 252, I'm pretty sure. The roll. Okay. Let's see. Um, What else would I want a one shot? I suppose. Hmm. What's good in this format that I'm not thinking of? We definitely already one shot Urshifu with play rough. I'm not concerned about that. Our coverage move is Iron Head and Superpower. So I guess maybe at plus two, if we could like one shot Heatran. It's like max HP Heatran. I also might go Terra, Terra fighting. Yeah, Adamant plus one doesn't KO max HP. It should KO like faster Heatran though. Yeah, that one shots. Um, let's just make sure we one shot fast heat train and put the rest in the bulk. Yeah, 164, sure. Some of them are fairly fast. We'll do this. We'll do like let's do like an optimal number for leftovers recovery, which is gonna be 160 because it's divisible by 16. We'll put more into Spit F than into Fizz Def. That should be good. All right. Live Ursaluna facade when you're at plus one. That's not bad. Let's see. 84 4. Ursaluna. 52 plus. Or let's give it facade. Facade at Adamant Nature. And status burned with guts. I don't even know if that's possible to live at plus one, let alone. Yeah, I don't, I don't even think it's possible to live at plus two. That's a roll to live at plus two, but I guess it might be worth it to try to optimize for that. Let's see. I would have to do 44, 44, which just seems wrong. Dude, this is the most scuffed EV spread ever. I'm going to run it just because it's funny, bro. I'm going to run it just because it's funny looking. I don't think anyone's ever seen 44, 44, 44 on an EV spread. Yeah, that would let me live a facade if I was at plus two. I'm also Terra Steel, though, so that's like not even necessary. Eh, it's not. Okay. That's not even necessary. Um, Alphans, right? Terra Fire, Terra Steel. I might swap off Terra Steel. Is there a better Terra type I could run? Maybe Terra Flying, Terra Blast.
Actually, I'm going to do Terra Flying Terra Blast. Let's do that. Uh, for the Amoongus, I'm gonna steal an Amoongus. I don't feel like making a new Amoongus, bro. I'm not. I'm not thinking today. Expect me to use my brain? No, sir. Not using my brain. Where's a halfway decent Amoongus? He agreed it. That definitely has a halfway decent Amoongus on it. Sure. Actually, this Amoongus looks like garbage, but let's go with it. As for you, um, I suppose we can calc for Cresselia. Cresselia did get nerfed this gen. So let's check out Fluttermane with Specs, Shadow Ball. Definitely want to go Sassy Nature in this format. Maybe not Sassy, but like, you know, Calm or whatever. Um, with Beads of Ruin active, can I live this? Oh, yo, I think this is possible. It's a roll with Beats of Ruin active, but honestly, it's kind of a roll that's worth it, I think. Um, nah, we have Tinglu. It's not worth it. All right, let's just make sure we live, like, without any multipliers, just non-Beats of Ruin. Specs, yeah, we'll just do that and put the rest in the Fizz Def, which we just naturally live. What if the sun is up? Then we always die, right? Probably. The roll. It's so funny. It's so funny, man. Um. Chew Dark Pulse? Is Chew Dark Pulse weaker than Fluttermate? It is. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, Wicked Blow from Urshifu. That's just like natural ish. What if it's banded? We can't live banded, but we can just calculate this. And put the rest in the spit off. Yeah, 252, 36, sure. Or actually, I guess we can try to live that facade. Hold on. Ursa Luna. Because this is going to be our Trick Room Reverser, isn't it? With Burn. We naturally live that facade. What if we go, like, with a relaxed nature? And it's terrestrialized into a normal type. We can live that. All right, cool. Yeah, we're gonna live that facade. Because I think this might still allow us to live the Shadow Ball. Let me save that set. Right. Versus Fluttermane. No, now Shadow Ball's a roll. Was I not calcing for specs before? Am I stupid? Oh, sun is up. Okay, hold on. Let's just guarantee we live that and put the rest on. All right, cool. 52. Actually... I just realized we have two leftovers. Citrus Berry. Let me check something real quick. All right, so. We go to 248 and we live that. What if I get an even HP number? Relax nature. Versus Ursaluna. Burned. Paranormal facade. And we got 208 defense. 
roll to live. Cool. Sounds good. Two twelve. I mean, Do we live then. No, still roll. That's fine. Cool. You think Amoongus has citrus? I'm Rocky Helmet Amoongus. All right. Let's see if there are, if there are any tours. Let's see if there are any tours. If not, we'll do viewer battles. Should I go zero speed on my Cresselia? I don't even think it's worth it, really. Go bold. Because I'm not zero speed on this on this Heatran. All right. All right, cool. Dot tour. Reg D. OTS. Oop. Am stupid. All right. Well, go ahead and send viewer battles then. Go ahead. My username is Moxie Boosted. Um, actually, I don't even know what the code is. Uh, Yido Wheat, can you tell me the code in chat? I know you put it in the uh in the Discord the other day to send like viewer battles. There we go. Okay, cool. Um, let me copy and paste that into like a notepad so I don't lose it. All right, so cool. Guess we're doing some viewer battles for the rest of the stream. And yeah, we'll accept yours. We'll accept yours. Cool. Accept open team sheets. Hmm. Tornadus, Focus Sash. I get a lot more value out of Trick Room than they do. Maybe I should have gotten Iron Hands. I could also just lead off with the Silly Goose combo. Hmm. Rapid Strike Tornadoes. I also didn't read their team at all, bro. Ooh. The question is, can my guy live this hit with the rain up? Because I think he's just going to go for the rain. I think he's just going to Terra Grass and rain, dude. Obviously, please don't stream snipe during during viewer battles. Yeah, got the play right. Cool. Dang, I still got it off. Cool. Um. Honestly, I think this is fine. Yeah, get a little bit of damage off. There's that rain dance. I don't mind that, really. It's gonna be that dollar store Aqua Jet. Check this out. I 
No reason to helping him when Dazzling Gleam does it. Cool. How do I get rid of this? There we go. Where's the Jolden go? Give me that flinch, please. Nice little flinch. Easy flinch. Easy money. Easy money, as I always say. I don't say that. Hmm. I mean, my rock slide goes first anyways. And that would just guarantee I pick up the KO. Probably not a guarantee, but close. Actually, no, I just remembered that I'm staying on the field, bro. I'm stupid. All right. Um, I don't ever switch here. Actually, maybe I do. Maybe I don't. I think Flash Cannon does it. I think it might. They sucker punch me. I mean, with Tingle on the field, I should live. Oh, I don't live? What? That's insane to me that that didn't KO. Or that 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 just, like, KO'd me. With Ting Lu on the field. What's this thing spit F stat? God, Shadon's going slow. I probably have too many Chrome tabs open. One oh six. I'm surprised that KO'd. Are you like Metal Coat? Oh wait, I think he is Metal Coat. Yeah, that's that's the difference maker there. All right, GG. That's gonna be a forfeit from me. All right, let's try this one out. Okay, this is interesting. Actually, I feel like this is something I don't know about the Orthworm. Um, I thought like this is something I would see. Hmm. Covert Cloak on the Chimp How is interesting. Red Scarf, Great Tusk, Orthworm, Suing Typhlosion. They do have access to Tailwind. But I think that Tinglu just stomps all over their whole team conceptually. Alright, some more battles. Cool. Also, late game Palafin just seems busted. Still no Enamorous, unfortunately. I don't see a point for Enamorous. Cool. Hmm. Do too much. If you go for the shed tail, that's fine. I don't think they get anything in that eats this hit. Let me also turn on the timer. Dragonite? No, you're not eating this. Cool. Um I have an idea. Oh, that didn't do it. <laughs> Is that through multi skill? Yeah. Um. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna get e speeded. But I don't see a reason to switch. Earthquake. They don't have Earthquake. They are Terra Flying though, so that could hurt. You know what? Check this out. 
is the goat play. They're going to sucker punch me. Yep. I'm living. That was with a crit too. Nice. All right. Um, Trick Room should be free here. I'm going to recognize Heatran probably goes down. Actually, no, I keep Heatran around. They did already Terra though, so that thing's not really a threat. Okay. Yeah, I don't need Tinglo anymore. It's just Dazzling Gleam. Yeah, it's Scarf Tusk. We're fine. I just send in the Palafin. Helping Hand Jet Punch. That's game. GG. Well played. Body Press doesn't KO. Helping Hand this Wave Crash. I think that, like... I think that Palafin, Cresselia, Heatran is going to be like a solid combo. I think Ting Lu still has a place in the metagame. Except these as they came in. Oh, that's the wrong team. Alright, interesting. Honestly, I just really want to find a game where Enamorous can do slime, but so far we haven't seen a single Intimidate user, bro. That being said, I think an Urshu is actually solid. Into this whole crew, it's not bad. Wait, this is the wrong... That's the wrong game. Sorry. Wrong kind of game. That's doubles. <laughs> there we go. Uh, send the request again if you're in chat. That was the wrong kind of game. Okay, now we're talking. Now I can actually see this Enamorous do something. Dude, I think Palafin might be necessary in this format, bro. <laughs> it might actually be necessary the more I look at what's in this game. Yeah, they protect. Cool. Cool. Um... I mean, I'm slower than this thing. I'm actually fairly confident in this play. Oh, of course. Thank you. I love you, Cresselia. I'm glad you're in the game. I'm really glad you're in the game, Cresselia. I honestly forgot I got ally switch. I thought about it for a second, but I was just, I was like, man, my viewers would never run ally switch. All right, that's fine. What'd they do? Lunar blessing. Am I screwed here? I think I am. Cool. But it doesn't even do nothing to this situa. Shadowfall doesn't do much. Cool. All right, um, so the situation is slower than me. Check this out. They protect the decidui. I would have never, I would have never done that. 
personally, it could have never been me. All right, I still do that, bro. Actually, let's get in Ting Lu. Air water wave crash in this range should just KO. I do not understand the logic behind protecting the Sidhu either. Luckily, they're not life orb and amorous, so we're probably solid. Nice little KO. Live that. Easy live. Easy live. Um, Taunt, Moonblast, Mystical Fire. I don't think that they can KO. Heavy Slam do it? Yes, it does. Cool. Only issue is Cocaine Bear here probably one-shots me. Check this out. Nice. Doesn't quite one-shot, but that's good. Because now I can Heavy Slam Dazzling Gleam. doesn't KO because Ting lose the goat and that's game GG god I hate I hate <clears throat> ally switch so much <clears throat> excuse me I have coffee grounds in my in my throat all right Bambi Bambi All right, we're facing what I'm honestly going to think is like just honestly a standard Ursa Luna team in the, in the next coming weeks. I think Ting Lu is actually like invaluable for this format, bro. For Sully, Ting Lu is a match made in heaven. Ursa Luna is Terra Fire. That's great news for me. Iron Hands is Terra Fighting. Um, let's do this. Do I want to bring you? Man, I just want to find a game where, like, this Enamorous can do slam, but I'm just not seeing it most games. What if I do this? If I do that. Okay. Okay, this is serviceable. a sash they sunny day am are they gonna like set up terra blast or saluna yo that's a contrary boost bro that's a contrary i'll take it okay cool They don't protect in the tornadoes. Player off one shot's nice. Psychic does nothing. Oh my god. Wait, Tinglu like Enamorous could be a really good combo. Where's that Chi Yu? Bro. That Chi Yu? You know what we call it around here? We call it that dollar store Chi Yu. Check this out. That's that dollar store Chi Yu. Oh, it's Terra Grass.
You know, I think Rock Slide two shots. That was pretty close. Also Life Orb. Let's go Palafin here. Missed the Palafin's huge. I can Aqua Jet, or I can Jet Punch now, but I think this might just KO. Not quite a KO, but um, good enough that I actually want to do this instead. I think that they're going to want to go for Trick Room. How much did my Rock Slide do? You know what? Sun's almost over. There's not a reason to predict. Yeah. There's no reason to predict there. Rock slide, don't miss. Thank you. Sun's over. That's within jet punch range. I can just rock slide and jet punch this. Actually, no, I really like the Tinglu and Amorous combo. In, not into like every matchup. Obviously, there are a lot of matchups we've been facing today that aren't great. I think something I'm going to change is I think over like Stomping Tantrum, I actually do put Throat Chop just for extra stab. Because into the, into like the um, Cresselius, that could be really nice. Terrorblast is also not that bad. Dude, that Spideff boost that we get. Oh, that kind of sucks. Your specs, right? Yeah, so I just KO. Get an Arcracelia, Jet Punch. Nice. Look our play rough wave crash. Actually, let's get that KO with the play rough. Let's get that KO with the play rough. Why not? GG. Well played. Ah, no KO for us. Okay. Let's do uh this one. Ooh, okay. We have a Wo Chen enjoyer. A little Wo Chen enjoyer here. Aragrass, Ursa Luna. Yeah, this Tinglu's invaluable then. Honestly, I might drop um, Terra Blast for Taunt. Could be worth it. Let's try it. Let's go back to Terra Steel for future matches and put Taunt here. Um, Honestly, on lead, I see no issues with um, Heatran Palafin. Oh, yeah, Tinglu. Yeah, that's what I thought. Cool. Because they don't have any fire resists except for their own guy. Heat wave is fine here. They are Terra Water, but I don't think they would want to spend that. I'm just going to Heat Wave and get in the Tinglu. Doesn't do anything to Wo Chen. Get a nice little burn on the Cresselia. That's pretty nice. We lose our Choice Band, which kind of sucks, but it might be for the best. Flash Cannon Throw Chop. Yeah, it's going to do major damage to this. Air Blast doesn't do anything. Flash Cannon, nice. A little Spit F drop. Cool. Paragraphs, Flash Cannon. Let's go ahead and swap in our Cress. Say Ruination. Close Combat, nice. And that's going to KO from this range. Yeah, nice. Got rid of, honestly, the scariest thing on their team. I'm going to protect and reverse the Trick Room. Cool. Um, do they have Protect on that? Their Clear Amulet? They do have Protect. But honestly, I don't see a point in calling it out. A 
bit of damage there. They actually ice beat me. They're going to let me set up the trick room for them. Well played. Well played. All right. Double protect here. As they are not even attempting to do what I think they're going to do. What's their item on this? Assault vest. I mean, theoretically, they just lose to late game um, heat wave. I can stall it long enough. Are you gonna double my crest? No. Okay, that's what I thought. Cool. Awesome. Cool. Heat wave, helping hand. There's no reason not to do this. I guess Icy Wind might KO me, but I don't think it will because it's a Cresselia. Or Ice Beam might KO me. But once again, it's a Cresselia. No, I'm faster anyways. Cool. Ice Beam? Nice. It does KO me. Good to know. Um, should always win just by going for Protect Dazzling Gleam. Because they do Terra Water. They Trick Room on me. If they leave Storm, they lose here. My play is just going to be to Jet Punch and Helping Hand to make sure it always picks up. Uh, Jet Punch will pick up a KO here regardless. I don't really need the Helping Hand. It. Yeah. I was overthinking that. Cool. Let's... I mean, they lose now. They don't have recovery. Let's reverse that Trick Room just to get one more big attack off. Helping hand wave crash. Can't steal this too much. Cool. King Lu comes in. They need an ultra super mega crit to KO me, but Earthquake will just do it. Heck yeah. All right, cool. Good game. All right. Um, and I think we're going to have to call it there for today. I know it wasn't the longest showdown live session, but um, I do have stuff to do tonight. The first half of the stream had to get scrapped because of some... Uh, difficulties getting a team together but yeah uh that's gonna be it for tonight guys uh, i think the team's fine i think it's actually like a really decent combination an amorous ting lu with like balanced stuff in the back uh, i'll try it out in like a future video anyways if you guys enjoyed leave a like subscribe turn notifications i'll see you in the next one have a nice night bye